What's going on YouTube family? Hope you guys are having a great start to your day. I'm back in the game with another video and welcome back to my channel NC Tough TV. So guys, I want to talk to you about this Steve Harvey situation. And if you don't know, his show, his daytime show has now been canceled due to the simple fact that the ratings had dropped. Now we all know that Steve Harvey is the type of individual that loves to perform and put on a show for his employer, if you catch my drift. Steve Harvey is the type of brother that will clean their toilets, he will shine their shoes, he will answer all of their demands and commands, he does not want to disappoint his employer, alright? So now that I have his employer embedded into your head, I'm pretty sure that you catch what I'm trying to say. Now, you would think that somebody that they can control like a Steve Harvey, right? Would be able to hold on to his show. But let's run to the receipts and read what MTO News had to say in regards to this matter. And it states, talk show host Steve Harvey's talk show has officially been canceled. It suffered a rating slide after Steve embraced 45 and it never recovered. Before Steve aligned himself with the controversial 45, his ratings were almost unbeatable, but his numbers went on a decline once he announced his support for 45, especially among black viewers. Yesterday, the show came to a close after six seasons. The show launched in 2012. His wife Marjorie went on to Instagram to bid the Steve Harvey show a formal farewell. They taped their last episode yesterday and Marjorie posted this. So basically Marjorie just posted a photo of her and Steve kissing before his last show. And then it goes on to say that Steve bosses treated him like a dog when they fired him. Steve learned about his show being canceled after it broke on the news. NBC Universal gave his show time slot to newcomer Kelly Clarkson and they never even told him. Steve explained how the network basically ghosted him. I thought I was going to stay with NBC until they made an announcement a couple of weeks ago that they wanted to give Kelly Clarkson the owned and operated NBC networks. That's my slot, Steve said at the Variety Entertainment Summit last month. I don't know if it sold. It's not selling like they thought, but I thought it would have been nice of them to come to me. You know, family, I'm not the one to celebrate when one of our own loses something or they fail at something. I tend to uplift them and try to be as positive and classy as I can during the process. But with this situation happening to Steve Harvey, I hope that it wakes him up to see that the very individuals that he praised and that he tap danced for treated him this way in this fashion now also i do understand that he lost the viewership that he was once getting due to the simple fact that people just started canceling him once they saw that he went to go meet with 45 and he was standing in 45's presence grinning like a chess cat people were like no we're not supporting that and i have to give a shout out to our people that canceled him because you know, at the end of the day, sometimes you got to show your own folks tough love and you have to show them that what they're doing may be right in their mind, but it's not right for the overall outcome of equality when it comes to this country. So I hope that Steve Harvey learns that because you play up to your employer, it doesn't solidify your spot in Hollywood. They got rid of him and didn't even feel that he was an individual valued enough to tell him beforehand. That goes to show what some people think of you, no matter how you try to play up, no matter how much you shine shoes, they will still treat you as an individual that is devalued when it comes down to it. 
So I hope that Steve Harvey learns from this. I have no issues with Kelly Clarkson. I wish her well in her new venture. Hey, it is what it is. But this is a lesson for Steve Harvey. And I hope that he gets it. Anyway, guys, drop down in the comments and let a brother know what you think about this. Also, like this video and give it a thumbs up. Share this video, all right? And if you're new here, don't be afraid to subscribe to my channel and smash that notification bell to be notified of when I will drop my next video. It's been real. Peace.